There we go. So I'm Janine. I'm the founder of Smarter by One Degree. And I'm going to start off with just seeing who we have here in um, the webinar tonight. So maybe you can resonate with one of these things. For me and my family, um, this was me on all of them. I was overwhelmed with high school on what curriculum we were going to do, how I was going to pay for college. Would I prepare my student for college? Was I going to limit their options? Um, what about ACTs and SATs and all of these stresses? And so I, if you're here and you've been thinking about the same things, you're worried about the same things that I am, um, then you're in the right place. I hope that this helps you um, and you can see if this is a good option for your family and your student. Um, and hopefully I can educate you a little bit about the differences of dual credit and dual enrollment and what we offer. Um, so I first got a degree in human development and then I went back and got my teaching degree and I've been a teacher for 23 years and I started Smarter by One Degree because I was looking for an option for my daughter. Um, I could not find um, something that was focused on learning instead of busy work. It seemed like I could find that in elementary and middle school. And then when we got to high school, it was just busy work. Um, it just wasn't focused on learning. Um, I also didn't know how I was going to afford for college, like I just mentioned. And so for me, this was a big deal when I couldn't find what I was looking for. And so I was just crazy enough to say, if I can't find what I'm looking for and what's best for my daughter, then I'm going to create it. And so um, I have streamlined over the last seven years, Smarter by One Degree, so that I can offer what I did for my own daughter into your home. So you don't have to be a teacher. You don't have to be an expert. Um, what we do here is we try to support you and help you so anybody can homeschool high school. And in my opinion, not just homeschool high school, but to earn a bachelor's degree by the end of it. So our kids can be debt free, hopefully, um, but, but we're really trying to strategize so our kids can learn once, but earn twice. And so this, as you might have guessed, is my daughter. Over the last um, seven years now, um, I have helped thousands of students. I've been so blessed. We have an amazing team. And again, what our job is here is to try to make this possible for any family that wants to do this for their kids. So I just love sharing a little bit about myself. I'm so passionate about education. And so what I, um, one of the questions I get all the time is, okay, maybe your daughter did this, but she must be a genius. And you probably locked her in the basement 10 hours a day because how else could somebody get a bachelor's degree by the end of high school? Maybe you've heard about getting an associate's by the end of high school and you already know what that looks like. But my daughter was able to play sports year round. We were big into volunteering and um, I have 21 family members that live within a five minute um, radius from me. And so family was so important. And giving my daughter the time to do all of these things that are so great about why we homeschool, um, but having the time to also get that bachelor's degree. So my program is designed where students spend three hours a day um, throughout high school, and they have time for everything else that we want them to be able to do. Um, a lot of my students get jobs once they're 16. Um, my daughter was an artist, so she started her own small business. She had her own Etsy account. Um, and so I just love that not only can we give them a quality education um, so that they earn their high school diploma and a bachelor's degree, but they can also do all of those things that you can only do as a teenager. Um, and so I love for our kids to experience everything that is available to them, as well as maybe building career skills or exploring different um, career options that are out there. So no, she wasn't locked in the basement 10 hours a day. No, she wasn't a genius. I'm going to show you how anybody can do this. 
Um, and then again, we're going to wrap support around you so that you don't feel like you're on your own if this is what you want to navigate. With dual enrollment and other things out there, what I found when I was going through that is that I had to piece it together. I had to figure it all out. It was so much time out of my day um, was spent on this that I started to not have enough time to spend with my daughter. And I felt like, am I the only one at home spending like 20 hours a week researching what's best for our kids um, and how to help them as homeschooling parents? That's not what I want for you. So we've streamlined it and perfected it over the years so that everybody can give their kids this option if it's a great fit for you. Again, like I mentioned, three hours a day is our program. And so that is what we are. Um, that is anybody. We have students with um, different learning challenges, special needs. We help students that are gifted and talented and advanced. The key is that it's self-paced. So if you have a student that um, takes longer for math, awesome. If you have a student that is quick at math, awesome. This is where everybody goes at their own pace. And this is where everybody finishes within that three hour time frame. All right. So I know you're reading the slides, so I'm going to go to the next one. Um, I'm trying to get everybody in here and see. Um, okay. I think you got in or you can hear me now. Sorry. Okay. Here we go. Sorry. So this is one of our families that I love sharing about. In my mind, when I first started learning about dual credit and these other options, I wanted to hear from other families that were doing it. I shared with you my experience and uh, my family and uh, how this was the best part of homeschooling for us. But I feel like we all want to see how it works for somebody else. And so Larissa here, um, her and her three daughters are in our program. And um, she has a senior in high school. She has a student that was in um, ASU in her first semester who then left school to come into my program because I don't know if you guys have heard this, but it's more common than you would realize. They moved her onto the ASU campus to live in the dorm and guess where her classes were. They weren't on campus, they were all online. So they spend all this money, all this time just for her to take online classes. So now their oldest um, is doing my program. And then you also see um, there's an eighth grader in the program. There's no age minimum. It's you knowing your student best. Again, you can take as long as you want. Um, there's never a hurry on our side. This is completely up to you guys and it, whether you homeschool four days a week, you homeschool five days a week or what that schedule looks like. So it gives you all the flexibility that you want as homeschooling parents. Um, what's so great is while she was doing this with her kids, she decided after being a dental hygienist for 20 years that she was going to um, finish her bachelor's degree through Smarter by One Degree. And so her and her two oldest daughters graduate in six weeks with their bachelor's degree. And it's so exciting that it works for the whole family. Um, what's just neat is that um, she's now also our marketing manager and we love her to death. And um, she shares with families her own personal experience, which is what I hope to do tonight to kind of um, share real life stories so you know that this is for everyone, not just um, maybe um, one type of family. I just keep over clicking, sorry guys. Um, so affordability, a flex, um, flexibility and efficiency is, in my opinion, what we all want and need. Um, dual enrollment, one of the things, even though dual credit or dual enrollment are both great and give benefits, um, the difference is, is that in a dual enrollment environment, you are enrolled at that university. So you have all of the homework, you have all of the busy work. You have deadlines and due dates and everything that goes with that, where with dual credit, 
we don't have to do the homework and the busy work. There's zero deadlines and due dates. And so what I find is that kids do better in that atmosphere. It's more age appropriate. Um, we have a lot of kids who come very stressed out from the dual enrollment that they've been doing other places. Um, and so it's added anxiety and other things on their plate that as parents, we don't want for our kids. We love the idea of efficiency and learning once and earning twice. But at the end of the day, we don't want them to sacrifice um, their teenage years and add anxiety and stress on their plate. So I'm going to talk to you more about that. But one of the three, these three highlights for me are that this program offers affordability, flexibility, and efficiency, because I want efficiency in whatever I do. Um, this is Trinity, and I love sharing her story, because another common question that I get all the time is, if I do this program and my student earns this bachelor's degree, can they go on to um, grad school? Can they go on to law school? So I love using Trinity as an example. I helped her um, throughout high school and we were able to get her into an Ivy League law school at 18. Um, and so what I love is that she was able to homeschool. She was on a traveling debate team. She volunteered at her senior year. She worked part time and she was able to get into law school, which gave her a six to eight year lead on the average person that enters law school. So again, if you have a student that's advanced, um, and they're bored with school or you they know where they're going, this can also allow them to save four years or more on what they would spend in high school and then the bachelor's degree. Again, the idea is, is that they're going, I think it's on the next slide, they're going to go ahead and go on and um, be able to take one class, which let me go over kind of what's different about, again, our dual credit. These classes are not like the typical dual enrollment, what you're picturing, like I spoke about just a minute ago. These lessons are five to, um, five to 10 minutes long. They're focused on learning without the busy work. And the great thing is, is that every lesson was designed for a visual and auditory learner. So what's great about that is that 65% of us, whether we're six, 16 or 60, we all learn best um, when we see the information. Another 30% of us is, um, learns best when we hear the information. So that's 95% um, of us that learn best when we see and hear information. And so that's the lessons that your kids are going to be doing. That's what is different about this program. So a lot of people come into this thinking this is exactly like everybody else. And I'm here to tell you that it's different. This is where our kids are understanding the concepts. They're focused on learning. They're back to being engaged with learning. And that's what leads to the retention um, of this information long-term. So that excites me. Um, I try to think of an example of one of our past students to kind of explain every situation so that that way, again, it's not just me telling you that this is great for students with different learning challenges. But for me, it really makes a difference to see somebody who was successful in the program. So as you see here on the slides, there was a lot of different learning challenges that were going on to where these parents thought their student would never um, be able to go to college. Um, they just knew it wasn't in the cards. They weren't going to be able to do it. They came across me over four years ago, and I helped him throughout high school. And by it being self-paced, because it was homeschool to where it still had that flexibility, um, he was able to graduate at 16 with his bachelor's degree when they never thought he'd have a chance to go to college at all, even after high school. So I love this family. Um, what I love is that he is a pianist rock star. He, <laughs> those are all his trophies. I love it. Um, and I love seeing them pop up in my Facebook feed. But again, not only is it for students that need some remedial support, they're at grade level, um, they have learning challenges. Um, 
kids can succeed because it's not the typical model of that busy work and those deadlines and due dates. So I love sharing his story. This is where, again, that learn once, earn twice. Um, if your student is going to take, say, American history, um, you know that we take it in high school and then we take it again in college. So I went to college thinking I'm going to be a teacher. I'm so excited to learn about um, how to be a great teacher. And then I got to college. I'm like, why am I in American history again? Why am I taking biology and English and um, all of these classes that I just finished in high school? And so dual credit allows us to take one class and earn the high school credit and the college credit at the same time. So your student will be able to have their high school transcript and meet all of their high school requirements, as well as meet all of the college requirements. What we do and what I love to do is map out the most efficient path to earning a bachelor's degree. So we don't just pick classes randomly. We've gone through and we pick the best classes based on feedback from parents, feedback from students, um, an overall well-rounded education so that every one of our students get that type of education for high school and college. So you'll see that your kids will have classes like entrepreneurship, personal finance, um, leadership, management. We could take any classes to meet certain electives, but we really try to give them um, a well-rounded education, but there's also another benefit to that. What we're trying to do is help your student learn about themselves. We want them taking these different classes so that they can see what their interests are, what are their strengths, what would they be good at for a career. Um, that's what we want to focus for our kids. And so we have handpicked every class for a specific reason. Um, and we find that the kids do so well with that. And we get feedback from parents later of how their kids were able to transition into grad school or transition into trade school or a job with these career skills that sets them up for success. So I love doing that for all of our kids. Um, this is Connor and I'm trying to remember why Connor is in here. I love Connor. Um, he has, um, I helped him for over four years and he also graduated. Um, but I'm just trying to think, um, I'm sorry, I'm spacing on it. So I'm going to go to the next one, but we have different um, testimonials and stories on our website, um, as well as in our Facebook page and group, because we try to share real stories um, with our um, families who want to hear from other students. Connor's amazing. He even um, started his own landscaping company while he was doing his bachelor's degree. And so that's what he's doing right now. But I love that he's considering now grad school or even law school because he feels so confident and empowered that he has his bachelor's degree. So it's been really neat to see kids' confidence building um, in that area of education to where kids who never thought about grad school or furthering their education feel like they have the opportunity to do that. Um, so that personalized learning pathway, that's that roadmap. So we meet you one-on-one. -on -one. If your student has any other credits, we're going to plug them in there so that they get all of their credits. And then we can map out the best route to the finish line. Um, I like a roadmap. I do not want to take the long way. I'm not even the person unless I'm on vacation. I don't want to take the scenic route. I don't want to hit the construction. I don't want to be in a car accident. I want the most direct route. And that's what I um, love to do is to strategize and help you help your student have the most efficient path. And so that's what we do. We don't stop supporting you there after you have the roadmap. That's what we're here for from day one through graduation. And so that's another thing that I love to point out. There were so many helpful groups 
and different places that I learned information years ago. But again, it was so time consuming to piece things together. So what I did is I went to the universities and partnered with them and said, what are the classes that my students can take? Here is what I want them to take. How can we get this guarantee so every student that takes these classes will end up with your bachelor's degree? So if you didn't know, I do not issue the bachelor's degree. It will not say smarter by one degree. This bachelor's degree is regionally accredited. That's the highest in the U.S. So MIT, Harvard, any of those that you see, they're all going to be regionally accredited. And that's where your student is going to get their degree from. The universities I deal with have been around for over 50 years. Um, and again, students can go to any further education that they are interested in. Um, this is one of my nephews. He was the second nephew um, to graduate last year. I had my cousin who graduated in December. And so I'd love to share with families that this is not just for you. This is for my family as well. It's been so neat. My nephew wanted to go on for his master's degree. And he came to me and said, um, how do I get my bachelor's for free? I want to be debt free for my bachelor's. And so we worked, we created him a roadmap. He went through my program and at a very young 20, he was able to graduate with his bachelor's degree. And so what I love is, again, is setting our kids up for success so that that way they can meet their goals. If the goal is debt free, I love to share options for you and um, how you can do that. This is where I just am a little bit of a nerd. Um, I feel like most people think that online learning or distance learning just started at COVID. So I love to give you just a little bit um, of the history so that you know that this is not something that popped up yesterday or last year. It might have been when you found out about it. But distance learning has been around since 1892. I was blown away when I found that out. And so this is not a new concept. Um, students have been learning successfully in that distance learning environment. Um, and so I wanna put you at ease that this is not something new. Um, another thing I get all the time is, is my student's degree gonna say online degree? It doesn't say smarter by one degree and it doesn't say online degree either. Um, as you know, most universities offer online classes and online degrees. Um, that's because everybody needs that flexibility to learn on their own schedule. So our classes, you can learn them at any time and anywhere. If you have a phone, you have a tablet, you have a laptop, um, you're able to learn. And that is one of the things I love. If you guys are a sports family, gymnastics, you name it, and you guys are in the van a lot or you're traveling, these lessons can be done anywhere. So this is where um, that makes it so flexible around our homeschooling commitments. If you guys are in a co-op um, and all these other amazing, great things, this does not mean you have to stop them. This is, let's see. This is actually John uh, Turbin, who one of you, you said that he referred you. Um, I've known Johnny since he was in preschool. And what I love is my friends came to me and said, how do we do this? We don't know how we're going to afford it. Can you please help us to get creative and paying for it? And so I was able to recommend them um, so where Johnny got his job um, at Chipotle. He worked for three months, 20 hours a week. And by the end of those three months, Chipotle um, contributed up to $5,500 towards his bachelor's degree. Um, and so this was one way to help um, him not go in debt. So he's debt free for his degree and it helped out his family. But as you know, most of our kids want their first job anyway. So by being strategic about it, we were able to help pay off the student um, tuition as well as give him that experience and his first job. So I love sharing his um, example because I know for myself, I needed to think of ways to pay for college. 
Um, one of our families just sent us a, a listing that USC this year in the fall will be 95,000 for one year. That just blew me away. Um, how can anybody think that paying 400,000 for a bachelor's degree makes sense? Um, but that is not what I want for our students. I'm here to help save um, us time, save us money, and earn a quality education. And so, again, I love sharing these other ways to kind of be creative. The way that your students earn credit through these dual credits is it's called alternative credit. How many of you have heard of CLEP, AP, um, NCCRS, ACE, um, Dante's, DSST, there's so many of them. And most people are surprised to find out that they've been around for a very long time. This isn't something that um, just happened. I know when I found out about it seven years ago, I just couldn't even believe that all of these options other than say CLEP or AP existed. Um, this is what people have been doing. Students have been doing this using alternative credits for all these years to save time and money. Um, and that's what my goal is for your students is how can we earn this college credit, but how can we do it affordably? I think this is the last testimony. This is Jake. I love it. I helped him for actually five years. He just graduated two weeks ago. Um, with his bachelor's degree. But what's unique about him and why I share his story is because Jake worked full time as an actor and musician. And so his family was worried that he wouldn't even be able to get his high school diploma, let alone ever go to college because he was working. Um, and so what's so neat is that Jake not only graduated by 19 with his high school diploma and bachelor's degree, but he's on set working in LA and I just love to share this because we do have some students that just, they can't wait to work. They can't wait to be involved in something. Maybe you own your own business and your kids help out. This can be done while still doing that. So if you have a kid who just can't wait to work, they can still work while doing this. That's of course the flexibility that homeschooling allows. Um, all right, so our whole goal here is to save time without compromising on the quality of education. So we're not taking shortcuts for education. We're taking shortcuts by cutting out busy work, homework, and wasted time. By cutting that out, we're allowing our kids to just focus on learning and get back to enjoying learning. Um, and so my daughter went from the typical, I don't know if your kids have ever done this, what did you learn today? And then they say, I don't know. Um, that switched to where my daughter was finally talking about what she was learning. Mom, did you know that X, Y, and Z? It was so exciting because when all that busy work and stress got removed, she was loving learning again. And so that's what I want for your students. We're going to save money by earning alternative college credits and transferring them to one of our partner universities that accept those credits so that you can earn a $69,000 um, bachelor's degree for um, 10,000 or less. That's where we get that savings. I partner with them. I offer you a 20% partnership discount. Um, and so that's how we get that cost done. Same degree, same accredited degree. Um, I like to give the example, if I go and buy something say at Walmart, and then I buy something at a high-end store, I'm expecting a different quality and a different result. This is the same quality, the same accredited degree that you can take anywhere. Um, so you're getting the lower price, but you're not sacrificing the quality. And that's really important to me. The other biggest thing that I am passionate about is helping homeschool families so you have the support you need. So again, that means from the beginning when we meet with you one-on-one -on -one to help figure out your students' educational goals all the way, whether it's throughout the week, whether it's at the end, we help you with the university, we help you with the transcripts, 
We have a private VIP support group where it's other families just like yours. It's other kids just like yours doing the same classes, earning the same degree. This is where we celebrate each other's wins. Um, Wednesdays is my favorite day to see everybody um, shares if their student earned any college credit that week. And so we want to offer this supportive, um, encouraging environment and then answer your questions so that we can help you not spend your time researching through groups and forums and articles. We want you spending the time with your kids. And so that's our goal for you is to offer that guidance and advising as well as support. Um, this is just some of the things we provide to you, a customized schedule. Again, you're going to have a high school plan as well as a college plan. You're going to know the exact classes you're going to, your students are going to take. What I like to um, give an example of, sorry, I'm trying to watch who's trying to join. Um, we, our goal is uh, to give you that expert status on day one. So for example, I don't know about you, but a lot of times in life we do something and then by the time we've done it for a couple months, we're like, man, if there was somebody to tell me the tips and tricks or the way to do this correctly, I wouldn't have had to learn the hard way. Experience is what gives you those insights. And that's the experience that we have of helping several, um, several thousand students. That's what we want for you and your student on day one. We want to give you all of the tips and the tricks and the know-how on how to do the classes, how to be successful in them, how to navigate everything. So that way, from the day one, you're not figuring it out. Remember, all of us are doing the same thing. I already did it. My daughter graduated two years ago with her bachelor's degree. And so my goal is how to use the experience and expertise that I have so that everybody benefits from that and that you don't have to spend all those hours researching and figuring it out. 